Hi, my name is Justin Conway. Today I'm going to show you how to deep fringe an image in Adobe Photoshop. The reason you might want to do this is when you cut and paste uh, images and pieces of images from one place to another, especially if you're using the feathering tool or other uh, sort of smart tools, uh, you'll get the, this sort of uh, fringing effect, which is pixels that occur around the edges of the image. Um, so let's take the one that I have here. Uh, here's a picture of me that I uh, use the lasso tool, the magnetic lasso tool. To, um, to crop out, and I pasted it into this, uh, this area here. And as you can see, there are these stray pixels all around the outside here. And sometimes it can get pretty bad. This, this image isn't terrible, but uh, we'll use it. And um, so what you want to do is first zoom in very close on the image that you want to edit. Select the layer that will be edited. Go into Layer at the top, Matting, and Defringe. And then let's just start with one pixel. You'll have to you'll have to sort of play with this to see what works for you and uh, how much defringing you're going to need. But uh, let's click OK. And as you can see, it's sort of um, blended the stray pixels uh, into the background. Let's undo it so that you can see. See now it's very pixelated, and now it's sort of blended um, when I redid that. Uh, so that's the way to sort of. Um, so that's basically how to take the pixels that are sort of stray around the edge, fringed, and defringe in Adobe Photoshop to make your images a little bit less uh, pixelated. My name is Justin Conway. I hope you enjoyed. Thanks.